Greetings and welcome to the introduction to astronomy. One of the things that I like to do in each of my introductory astronomy classes is to begin the class with the astronomy picture of the day from the NASA website that is apod.nasa.gov apod. And today's picture for July the 28th of 2021. Well, it is titled Ring Galaxy AM 0644 minus 741. So what do we see here? Well, this is an example of what is known as a ring galaxy galaxy a little larger than our Milky Way about 150,000 light years up across. And we see the ring is a bright blue ring of newly formed stars. Now, how do we know that they're newly formed? Well, because they're blue. Blue stars are very hot and extremely massive. And the bright ones that we're seeing here uh, that make up this the many billions of them here that we see are all parts of uh, this galaxy and they do not live for a very long time. So if they only live for tens of millions of years at the most, they must have formed within the last few tens of millions of years. Otherwise, they would all be gone they would have gone through their lives and we would no longer see them. So just the fact that we can see them and especially see them in this concentration means that they must have formed relatively recently. Now we how do they form and why do we get this galaxy in the shape of a ring? We're used to seeing spiral galaxies and elliptical galaxies primarily. Well, the, the ring was likely due to a collision of this galaxy with another one. So perhaps another galaxy passed through it and collided with it. And you might get the ring of intensity occurring much as you see when you throw a rock into a pond where waves will come out. And the density waves there could then enhance star formation in in ring like shapes further out. So that's where the gas and the dust were that were able to form, begin to form these new stars. So star formation would have gone on at a regular pace here as it would in an ordinary spiral type galaxy. But when there's a massive collision between galaxies, it can greatly enhance the star formation rate and allow us to see far more gal far more star formation than we would be used to seeing. Now what will happen eventually is that this will call calm down and eventually come back to normal. So eventually we would not see anything here. It would look just like a normal galaxy. We do have to wait hundreds of millions of years for everything to settle back down. But most galaxies, including our Milky Way, have probably undergone collisions like this in the past. That doesn't mean they're all ring galaxies. They may have had that may require a specific uh, mass of another a galaxy colliding with it in a specific orientation with which it hits. But the collisions and the enhanced star formation do occur with all galaxies over their lives. And in fact, that is how galaxies grow from the very small galaxies that formed after the Big Bang to the large spiral and elliptical galaxies that we see today. And the ring galaxy here is just one example of that. So that was our picture of the day for July the 28th of 2021. It was titled Ring Galaxy AM 0644 minus 741. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture preview to be the flower and the black hole. So we'll see what that is about tomorrow. And until then, have a great day everyone. And I will see you in class.